welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome thank you for stopping by my name is Nisha and I'm a perfume addict yeah I have a serious problem I just love fragrances I love candles I love air fresheners I love anything that smells good so yeah I think I have a problem <laughs> anyway guys on a serious note this is my birthday haul yes two days ago was my birthday thank you so much to everyone who sent birthday greetings I really really appreciate it thank you thank you thank you and for this month I've been you know gathering like a little squirrel gathering some fragrances for my birthday haul and I think guys I think I did enough I have some still coming in the mail and I think that's it for me for the year I need to cut it off I need to stop and I need to enjoy my fragrances. I need to go through what I have and enjoy them. So I need to stop. So I don't think I'll be purchasing anything until next year. Fingers crossed. <laughs> anyway, guys. So if you're interested to see what I got for my birthday haul, please stay tuned. So let's start with my favorite house, Killian. So as you guys know, I have a bunch of Killian and a lot of them I have in the travel uh, set or maybe the refill bottles. So I, I'm trying to get all of the pretty bottles. So, but I haven't, I had a, um, a travel set in this one, but I wanted to get the full one. Oops, there we go. So this is the Killian Intoxicated. Pretty box, it just sits in here. So yeah, Killian Intoxicated. These bottles are really pretty. So this one, mm, this one is so perfect for this time of the year. It's warm, it's spicy, it has cardamom, it has nutmeg, it has mocha coffee, and vanilla. Mm. Mm. It's so warm and snuggly and intoxicating. I really, really love this fragrance now guys this is not a review this is just to show you what I have I'll give you a bunch of notes you know if I have them but it's not like an in-depth review so yeah so this is intoxicating by Killian put Killian away so let's stick to Killian because I got a bunch of Killian the other one I have <laughs> guys I have travel sprays I have refills I have like three of these but I wanted the bottle love love don't, everything's falling out love don't be shy I absolutely love this one this one comes in the white bottle it used to come in the black bottle as well some people have the black so as I said I have the travel spray in this and the refills and all that but I love it so much I just wanted to have the full bottle okay I wanted this pretty bottle so this is described as a warm floral it has orange blossom it has vanilla it has marshmallow if you like sweet scents you would love this. It's sweet, but not in a juvenile way. It's sweet, but sexy. It's intoxicating. It's long lasting. You don't have to worry about um, longevity with this, okay? It's long lasting. So yes, Killian Love, beautiful fragrance. There. Okay, uh, I think I have one more Killian. Where are you? Oh, there we go. Let me take it out of the box. So this one, my third Killian here on this haul. This is Woman in Gold. Now, I spoke about Woman in Gold in my other video. So I spoke about this. You guys know that I love it. It's a beautiful fragrance for the fall. It's so classy. It's so elegant. It's sweet. It's very, very beautiful. I have the travel set in this, but I wanted the bottle, as I said. So yes. So this is Woman in Gold. So yeah. That's another Killian that I have. Okay, let's move on to something else. I've been eyeing this for a while. And every time I go into Sephora, I would spray it. And I'm like, ooh, this is a nice vanilla. I want to get it. And finally, I bought, you know, I bite the bullet and I got it. Serge Luton's Umbois Veni. I hope I said it right. This is a really nice, uh, spicy vanilla. It has Mexican black vanilla. It has sandalwood. It has licorice. This is described as a, uh, like a, it's a gourmand, but it's spicy. You get that vanilla. 
but it's not that overly sweet vanilla. It's not your regular vanilla. It's a very mature vanilla. I really like this and for this time of the year, it's nice. This is not a beast fragrance or anything. It's just, it's to me, it sits closer to the skin, but it lasts quite a bit. So yes, that's Umbwa Veni by Serge Luton. Actually, this is my first Serge Luton. I don't know anything from this brand, but I want to get some more. I have a decant of Shergi, I think it is. So yeah, Umbwa Veni. Let's see now. Hmm, which one, which one? Ooh, let's go to this one. Now, I was in, um, was it Holtz? Yeah, I was walking around and I was just sampling stuff. And this was the first one I sprayed and I went on about my business and I came back and I told the girl, she gave me a sample of it and I said, oh, I'll play with it and see if I like it and I'll get back to you. But before I left the store, I purchased it. <laughs> I'm like, girl, just, just bag it up, just bag it up. This is YSL Tuxedo. Now, one gorgeous fragrance. This is up my alley. This is the type of fragrances that I really, really love. I got the smaller bottle. The bigger one is too much. I have too much fragrances to buy those huge bottles. So yeah, this is Tuxedo. Guys, this is it's very nice packaging. Magnetic. Tuxedo. Mm. Now this, I think it's unisex. Oh, I don't even know if it's male, but... That doesn't matter to me. If I like it, I'll rock it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes. This has top notes of violet, violet leaves, bergamot, coriander. The hat, it has rose oil, lily of the valley, black pepper, the base, ambergris, patchouli, and bourbon vanilla. Guys, when I tell you a sexy, sensual, Mm, okay, it's so so good. I absolutely love this. And I when I posted this on Instagram, AI the Great, hey girl, she said try blouse. And somebody else said uh Kaftan. So I went yesterday and I tried them and I absolutely love blouse. So maybe blouse would be my collection, but not yet, okay? Maybe next year. But I absolutely love this. This is so deep. And it's smoky a bit. I really, really enjoy this. So this, I'd be rocking this for the fall. Absolutely, absolutely love this. Okay, which one? Let's do another one. So guys, I heard Abby, hi Abby, from Sherry's TV, talk about this fragrance. So I ordered it. She said it's the exact dupe to Tom Ford Noir de Noir. Is it Noir de Noir? yeah so of course i had to order she said it lasts longer and da 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 so i'm like you know what i'm gonna order this look at this bottle i know you guys probably see this a lot but it's pretty and it's very heavy and this was so cheap it was not expensive at all when i say so cheap not so cheap but it was cheap considering the price for tom ford but guys when i tell you mm, whew, yes it's <laughs> girl <laughs> it smells exactly to me maybe a slight difference but listen if you don't know the difference you wouldn't know like if you put it on you'd be like oh that's tom ford it smells freaking amazing it's very intoxicating so i'm so happy that i got it okay so that's um what is it called club nui intense for woman so yeah i got this one now guys being the psychopath that I am. Although I have that and it smells exactly like it, I wanted to get the original Tom Ford Noir. I love Tom Ford fragrances. So I'm like, uh, although that smells like it, I want the original. So yeah, this came in yesterday actually. So I got this Tom Ford Noir. Look at this. And I got the 100 ml because I know I'm gonna be abusing this. This is one gorgeous, sexy, you smell the vanilla. It's so perfect for this time of the year. Actually, this could be one of the best Tom Fords that I have. I really, really love this. And Tobacco Vinny. This is absolutely, absolutely stunning. Okay, guys, you need to try it, especially for this time of the year, the fall and winter months. Ooh, but you know what? 
it's not even that heavy i think you could get away with this in the spring and, and summer as well so yeah yeah that's tom ford noir okay this is a nice evening out well dressed you know sexy kind of fragrance date night mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah noir day noir so guys i've been hearing about this uh brand on youtube i have no experience with them i never own anything from them but i keep hearing about this brand and i was very curious so i said you know what i'm gonna try one from the house and i got this this one i i posted a picture of this on my instagram so you've probably seen it already connor carnier barcelona tardis it opens up like this and it's the big bottle 100 ml tardis t-a-r-d-e-s tardis look at this very simple bottle it's kind of clunky but the fragrance in here let me give you some notes it's the top notes geranium rose rosewood almond the middle note has plum celery cedar the base note has tonka bean musk and heliotrope this is a very soft to me it's a soft it's a soft airy kind of scent it's not doing too much it's an everyday scent as i say it's a signature scent you will be noticed it's it lasts really long the projection is lovely every time i wear this my son tells me i smell pretty so yeah this is a really nice fragrance and as i said it's just a nice everyday kind of signature worthy kind of scent so yes i've been enjoying this fragrance tardis by uh corner barcelona there's some other ones from this house i want to try i think it's palo santo and something else i can't remember but yeah so this i was just uh, dipping my toes into this brand with this one and I really really like it you know sometimes you want to wear that scent and you don't want nothing too obnoxious or you don't want something too loud and just a nice everyday it's a nice bedtime scent it's everyday going to work you know it's not an offensive scent it's very pleasing so yeah that's what I was trying to say hmm. all that to get to that it's very <laughs> inoffensive so yeah Kerner Barcelona Tardis so let's see what else I have here. For my birthday, one of my very dear friend, I'm not gonna call her name, so she asked me not to call her name, wanted to give me a fragrance for my birthday. She loves this fragrance and she's like, girl, you need to have it. And she sent it for me for my birthday. This is Armani Code Cashmere. It's discontinued, apparently, but she says, I would love it and I'm like girl thank you so much you know who you are I really really appreciate it and actually came this morning in the mail so perfect timing I still have some more fragrances in the mail guys so I might have to do a part two I'm trying to squeeze everything into this one so yeah this is a morning cold cashmere this is a beautiful fragrance okay it has notes of orange blossom sandbag jasmine heliotrope iris almond milk it has leather patchouli suede and incense guys this is such a stunning stunning fragrance okay i tried it on my skin today i got it so i don't know about longevity i don't know about projection i just sprayed a little bit and i was just you know doing my stuff and then i started doing my video so i'll get back to you but thank you girl i love it so yeah, you know, well, I hope you know that I love Initia fragrances. I absolutely love them. Now, when I tell you quality fragrance, when I tell you longevity, projection, sillage, you name it, Initio has it, okay? They don't play. They have some of the richest, most beautiful fragrance. My first love is Side Effect. That was the first one I purchased from this brand, and I absolutely love it one i got recently is this beautiful look at the packaging man look at this this is a little sleeve it comes out and the fragrance sits in here let me be careful because this will fall look at that this is blessed baraka stunning it has a little booklet here it sits in this guys oh my god i didn't know and all these i blind bought because there's no way to smell this fragrance here, right? 
some of the notes in this. The top notes, it has musk, sandalwood, amber, white flowers, vanilla, and the base note, it has musk again. So it's a very musky fragrance, but when I tell you, I was so impressed. I wore this, actually I wore this once. Yeah, once, I haven't worn this since, but I wore it once. And I'm telling you, the first hour, I got three compliments. The first hour. It is beautiful. A lady made me write down the name because she said I smelled so good. Listen, man. I think there's more notes to this because this doesn't seem... This has something else in this. I smell a little smokiness. I smell... It has more ingredients. There's a little bit of sweetness. I don't know if it's... It's kind of cherry you note. Know, not really, but... I don't know guys I don't know sometimes I can't differentiate the, the different notes in it something might smell like something but it doesn't really have it I'm not a note specialist okay I'm not a perfumer all I know is when I like it I like it and when it's good it's good okay I don't know about all these fancy notes I try to find the notes to give you guys but notes as I said it doesn't really matter what notes once it's good and guys this is good so yes, Initio, uh, Initio Blessed Baraka. I am loving this, okay? And maybe there might be another Initio on the way. Who knows? You never know. <laughs> anyway, guys, yes. Blessed Baraka. This other fragrance is my unicorn, okay? <laughs> I've been eyeing this forever. And I said, you know what, Nisha? You deserve it. I am going to buy you for my birthday. And I wore this for the scent of the day. Now, I'm not gonna get too much into notes and all that, I'm just gonna show it to you because I wanna do a separate review on this. And guys, I was back and forth on Instagram with Eva Monroe because I know she loves this fragrance and I was asking her about stuff and yada, yada, yada. Anyway, I decided to get it and she told me, she said, girl, get the, me the men's version because it's so much better. My first rosia, and I'm sure it's not gonna be my last. Look at this. Look at this classy fragrance, okay? This, guys, OMG. This is very warm and spicy and deep and rich. I absolutely, absolutely love it. This, oh, I didn't even say the name, my bad. It's the Pure Parfum. It's um, Creation E for men. Yes, Creation E. Did it even say on the box? No, but yes, Creation E. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna do a, a full review on this. So I'm not gonna get too much into it, but just know that I love it, okay? Yes, mm, this was my birthday scent. So yes, this is my little unicorn. <laughs> so, and I, and I purchased this um, from Twisted Lily, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful packaging. If it's nothing, the packaging is bomb. So guys, thank you so much for staying with me and having this lovely chit chat, looking at my fragrances. Thank you so much for all the people that took the time from their day to wish me a happy birthday. Send me DMs, Instagram, everything. I really, really appreciate it. I had a blast. My birthday was awesome. My family made it very special and my friends. Thank you so much. And until next video, until next haul, I'll talk to you later. Be safe, be kind, and smell fabulous. Bye now.